again, bummer. We don't have a bell because Luca ran off with it. Ding! And this is kind of a new artist because we have listened to him in a band that we really did here on the channel. But before we get there, if you're new here, you're at Rob Squad Reactions with your girl Amber. And your boy Jay. And today we're listening to Lou Graham. Um, you guys said he was the lead singer of Foreigner. 40. Of course we've heard him. Um, oh yeah. From 1970s to the 1990s I believe, so a long career. Today we're checking him out solo. The song is Midnight Blue. If y'all are new here to the channel, hey, make sure you like this video, subscribe down below, and turn on that post notification bell so you never miss a video. Foreigner, goodness, they, they've got some good ones. And you know, it's funny to me. I want to know. What yes, like when we think of Foreigner, of course, the vocals stand out. So I'm excited to see what we're going to get separate. <laughs> that That's what I think of when I when I hear Foreigner. That's a good moment right there. You like that? Yeah, clip, I like hey, that. Clip that. <laughs> <laughs> Lou Graham, Midnight Blue. Y'all know we got to give the people what they want. Let's check it out. He's got that strong, passionate, little bit of raspiness yeah. in his voice. I like I like Lou Grimm. I, mean, I like him in Foreigner, but I really like him by himself. Because I feel like we get the rock inside. And you get an amazing, amazing bass guitar riff. Yeah, I like definitely always rocking. But in this one, it, it has the guitar and the drum beat that makes you want to dance. Yes. Like, it's kind of the first thing that hits you. But then I like how they're using um, Cherry Red and Midnight Blue for, like, uh to describe kind of like the feelings, right. you know? Yeah. yeah, he's like, you know, your life's either gonna be cherry red, you know, that's what I'm thinking, like fiery, you know, on, you know, on top and then midnight blue, you know, close to black, dark. And so I, I like that that's kind of like a signature part of the song. Let's it's get, that play right there. Let's get back. Game, cause I'm the one who can feel the sun Right in the pouring rain I won't say when Don't know when But soon they're gonna come a day, baby I'll be back again. Yeah, I'll be back for you.
bass riff is sick. Strong. Y'all already know I liked it. It had a heavy bass riff, so I'm I'm with it. I like it. I think we need to do some more of it, and we need to do some more Foreigner as well. We haven't yeah, done enough Foreigner yet. For sure, and it's cool because um, when we did Peter Townsend, you asked, like, you know, why did they separate? Why did they separate? Right. And Same it was thing. cool reading down in the comments. They said, you know, a lot of times these artists, and I don't know if this is the case with, with Lou Graham and Foreigner, that they didn't separate from the bands. It was like they said sometimes it was like a necessity for them to be able to go out and, like, do something solo creatively for themselves, mm -hmm. like step out for huh. a minute, and then, you know, come back. But and it wasn't necessarily a bad thing, so. So that's the new interesting mm -hmm. take on watching the artists that we've seen in bands now, watching them go solo from gathering that information from the question you right. asked in the last video. Especially when you're in a band that's as great as Foreigner. It's like, or, or in the other ones, the Beatles like, why would you step out and do anything else? But that, that cre a creative release. Exactly. You no, know, nobody telling aspect. you like, oh, I would no rather, no, you got it. to fully do it your way. So that was no really doubt. cool. I but um, another part that I really dug about this song was, of course, his vocals. We know foreigner girl vocals. We focused on that, but I really liked the drum in this one. I like the drum was kicking. The, the, all the whole thing, as far as sound in this, was really, really raw. It was one that I think is definitely one that is a little bit more up your alley. Oh yes, no yeah, because it. it was rocking. It was fun. Like you said, it had some of the instruments that you really liked. But for me, the drums really stood out and really helped like kick the song off. It was fantastic. Maybe my minds are on drums because we got our son a drum set. All we hear is like. <laughs> All day because all the kids are home for Christmas break and so everybody's taking a turn on the drums. But Even it's dad. nice, especially Even dad. dad. He <laughs> might be the loudest, but I like it. You know, chaos is good. Loud is good. The guys, thank y'all so much for coming back from the videos. We always send you out of here. We love you. We thank you. We appreciate you. And remember, every single day that you wake up, it is a blessing and that you are blessed. And for your new family members, to hit that subscribe button down below. We welcome y'all to the RSR family. But y'all will go every day just like we do. Little Noah. Guys, you got to make somebody smile. We love you guys. Until next time, we'll see y'all later.